All right, Gulf Shores, man, insane boat crashes. Holy smoke, somebody's coming through the channel. Is this going to be a rough ride or are they going to make it through? It's all dependent upon the captain and Mother Nature. What's going on here? Are they going from Cuba to Florida? I do not know. All right, having fun? Yeah, it was fun. Now you're upset and your girlfriend's a little... Whoa! The World Barefoot Skiing Competition coming to a quick halt. These guys are doing a simultaneous boat race here. Looking like synchronized, synchronized swimmers out there. One more time for you here. This guy's playing leapfrog. Holy cannolis. Making a splash too. Look at that. All right, now this guy forgot to turn his lights on. <laughs> Hello, no one's home, but I need some fuel, people. Holy cow, look at this guy. He just, he said he forgot his rope, so he'll park on top of the dock. And this feller, oh, thought you were cool, but you're not. Now, this guy's got a jet engine on a boat, and I'm going to tell you what, it's about to get ugly out here. As he does a 360, lands her back down, splashes. Are we upside down? Are we good? Can we keep going? Got a cousin that can get that fixed. Here he is, boat repair cousins. He's a little upset about boat size here, I guess. I don't know, folks. Here we go. <laughs> Holy cow. He just ran out of talent. Here's his cousin, Savannah, Georgia, doing it big. Holy cannolis. Look at this. I don't even know how to narrate what was going on there. Okay, we're out for a nice evening stroll here. We've got the, whoa, boat came out of nowhere. These are always my favorites. Look at these rednecks. They didn't want to wait on the boat to get out of the way, so they just drug it down. That's good for the fiberglass, a little cement. Maybe they had some barnacles on the bottom. They needed to get those off before they got them in the water. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. And meanwhile, the yellow boat has three people trying to get it unhooked or hooked up. I don't know. I can't tell what's going on there. Uh-oh, these guys trying to get from Cuba to Florida, not looking too successful. All right, daiquiri's half off. Come ashore. Oh, and they're back out. Daiquiri's to go. Look at that. Uh-oh, sir! security surveillance. Uh oh whiskey throttle. We don't need no truck. This thing's out of here. We're loaded and gone. Uh-oh, get down, get down. Ooh, and that's... Dad's going to be pissed. No doubt about it. Dad is going to be pissed. Okay, now these guys are in a war to catch the biggest marlin. And the captain of this boat is not too happy about them coming over into their territory. Oh, that's not going to turn out pretty for somebody crossing the wake right behind the boat. Holy cow. There goes some guys sailboating. Well, man overboard. Hello. Holy cannolis. Look at this guy. And both guys are over. All right, now Aunt Sharon's wanting to go out in the boat. Oh! Yeah, I believe them guys may have done that on purpose. Here we are on the open water, what looks to be Naples, Florida. Uh-oh, they're going to catch this guy in the fishnet, I bet. Let's see what's going to happen next. Whoa, bald spot. That guy needs some road gain. And that guy's going to need some emergency assistance. There they are behind him. The Back the blue on the water. Looks like the police are chasing this guy down. I can't tell what's going on. Maybe you can tell me down in the comments. Is this Naples, Florida? I seen a trunk, fl a trunk, trunk flag. Okay, what's happening here? We got a pole out in the water, corks bobbing, big ships coming. What could happen next here? We see somebody with a Suzuki there. They had to go to Paradise Marine Center. Oh, uh, they're trying to flag this guy down. He's trying to cut their line or something. I can't really tell. Oh, he's going to hit that boat. Ooh. Pulverized, folks. And just like that, pushing it along, pushing it along. That boat is no longer a problem. 
All right, there's Gulf Shores man and Craig Bryan out catching some fish on the little lagoon when all of a sudden Corey Bryan and the bike share boat runs them over. Holy cannolis. You can see there Gulf Shores man trying to flag them down. Craig, they jump the boat. Oh, it's probably the best idea. And here we are once again with Daddy's boat stuck under the bridge. She said stop. He didn't listen. Dad's going to be pissed. He's still going, folks. There's going to be uh, several thousand dollars worth of damage there. Captain Crunch says it all in the caption. Hashtag Captain Crunch down in the comments if you like this video. Make sure you're liking and subscribing, folks. Tell your mom and him about it, too, because Gulf Shores Man is bringing you the content you love. Wow, look at that boat up there. Somebody wanted to use the... Holy smokes, we go from oil to fire, folks, all in one take. What are y'all doing down there in the water? They got a fire extinguisher? I don't know if that's going to help or not. I mean, you're in water. It's still on fire. Your fire extinguisher ain't going to do no good. This thing's going to burn till it hits the water. So y'all may as well let her go. Let her burn in a blaze of glory. You can call Papa John's and order a pizza to be delivered while y'all wait for the fire department. Could do that. Yeah, you could do that. Papa John's. I like to get extra pepperoni, and I like for mine to be well done. If you like your pizza well done, comment down below. Look at this guy. Whoa, thought you were going to be cool like the boat earlier, but you're not cool. Now this guy, he is cool. And look, he took all his cool friends down with him. Heads up for the jetties, folks. Sometimes when the tides come in, you can't see those rocks. Better be careful. Whoa, taking on some big swells with the party pontoon coming through the channel. This guy's taking water on. They turned around and said, maybe we don't want to be out here. Let's go back to the bay where the waters are a little bit calmer than we're supposed to be. Uh-oh, uh oh another case of whiskey throttle. Don't be on the boat trying to kiss and stuff, folks. Get out there and enjoy your family and get on gone. Now, what's happening here, these guys are about to flip. Uh-oh, Fido. Mmm. The doggy got a bath. Lord have mercy. Look at that, would you? Uh-oh, the lawn chairs are already knocked over. This party barge is through partying. Ooh, big mistake on the pontoon. Should have got a Paradise pontoon, folks. Paradise Marine Center, Gulf Shores, Alabama. You're going to want to hit them up for the proper pontoons. Uh-oh, this guy. Whoa. Get that water out of here. He acted like that was an emergency. Like he had to do that in a certain amount of time. Like I'm pretty sure that water had been in there for several years. Now, this is what you call a shipwreck, folks. No, they didn't actually crash into anything, but the ship's about to sink. Look at here. Airborne. Now, that's how you get through the channel, folks. He's got a Paradise pontoon party mat on the back. <clears throat> you can get those at Paradise Marine Center in Gulf Shores, Alabama. Be sure to like and subscribe for more funny content like this, folks. Look at this now, would you? Oh, it's like a seesaw out there. I bet he takes water on with the next one. It's like a magic carpet ride. Where's Aladdin? You know, wish you had a genie on this one. Ooh, good looking boat, though. I feel like they may have just quit on us. Nope, he's back moving again. He's got both of the Bimini's up. Better watch the winds take those things right away. And there is where he buried it up. Trim up, baby. Let's get that thing back to the boat landing. He's had enough for one day. You can only drink so much salt water. His wife's just slipped a disc in her back. She's getting another seat pad. Uh-oh. You never can. If you got a GMC Jimmy down at a boat landing and an old pontoon, that's a video you got to catch. Thanks for watching. I'm Gulf Shores, man. Like and subscribe.